I want to take a minute to talk a little bit about practicing what I've preached in the past, particularly recalibrating, life will throw things at you, have a bare minimum. This summer got away from us, from me. This summer I changed jobs in a very good way, but it was a job change. Uh, we did another Kickstarter for my wife's second book, and then we did way more events, way more intense events to sell her book. It's all worked. It's all worked great. The kids and having them over for summer just hit different this year. They're getting older, and that comes with new challenges and just, just new dynamics to balance out. The new job requires me to be in office more. That has changed dynamics more. And this is all happening at once. I'm just now. Oh, and, and I had a, a, a random micro Kickstarter in collaboration and on, on a big test. While I, all this is happening, I have to recalibrate. And I don't do it perfect every time. But I do it better each time I do it, generally speaking. And it's because I do follow my rules of have a bare minimum. I have been less active in my Discord because my bare minimum now is a certain amount of TikTok and whatever projects I need to push forward. That is my bare minimum as far as this realm of side projects of stuff I do at 11 o'clock at night go. Because... I can't let go of the very important things in my life. And I have those responsibilities. I have that job. I have those kids. Those are the number one priority. And so the bare minimum I can set for myself. I didn't even fall into my bare minimum of one tweet a day. I managed to keep up the TikTok. And that's wonderful. Because it also helps with the promotion of the micro Kickstarter. The point of this little, little tangent is that one... As I've said before, have bare minimums, be ready to recalibrate, life will throw you curveballs. The whole point is to be flexible, and if you have a bare minimum, you can build back up to where you were. I'm just now coming out of it, I'm just now starting to be able to breathe, and I have other big projects that I immediately have to hop into, but I feel equipped to do so because it didn't all fall out from under me. I didn't let go of all of my best practices, I eased up on some of them, and I know how to pick them back up. That is a very important thing. It takes practice. Like I said, I'm still not perfect at it, and I'm not going to be because every year it changes. The parameters, the dynamics, the what, the goals, the resources, they change, and so it's not going to get perfect, but I am getting better at managing those changes because I'm following the practice and I'm forgiving myself for not doing everything all the time all at once. I am doing what I can do, what I need to do. The thing I'll end this with is a saying I have force-fed myself and still have to. Is that I am capable of anything, but not everything. And you are capable of anything but not everything. And this was just a reminder of that for me in this moment and for you for when you hit that moment. Y'all have a great day. I look forward to interacting with you more in the future if I can balance it. Y'all have a good one.